If you look outside on September 27th, 2015, you can catch a glimpse of a very rare event in the night sky, a supermoon lunar eclipse. To understand what this is, First, take a full moon. Now add the closest approach the moon makes to the Earth on its elliptical orbit, which results in it looking up to 14% larger in diameter. That's a supermoon. Now combine this with a lunar eclipse, when the moon passes directly behind the Earth into its shadow, giving it a red tint. Now you have a supermoon lunar eclipse. Well, this is definitely a sight to see, and it's all happening right here at the Flandreau Science Center and Planetarium. You can check out behind me. Some folks are already set up. They've been here for a little while trying to get that perfect shot of the moon tonight. And as you can see, there's a pretty neat setup right behind me as well. Joining me now is a member of the Tucson Amateur Astronomy Association. Jim Knoll, you got here about an hour ago. Yep. Tell us about your setup, and what are some of the shots you're going to be able to get to see? The moon will rise about 610 and it'll go total about 711 and we'll have, have it for about an hour and 15 minutes and, and it'll be a great view. Uh, it was a sight to see the event we're talking about, the supermoon plus the total lunar eclipse, as you said, once in a generation event. No matter where you were in Tucson tonight, you could see this, a moon rising in the sky, disappearing and turning red. So hundreds at the U of A mall to see it and I got the best explanation of what's going on from an eight-year-old. Oh, look at that. It's already half gone. Right on. Now, how is that happening when the sun is still up in the air? We're still daylight. Now, how is that happening when the sun is still up in the air? We're still daylight. Now, how is that happening when the sun is still up in the air? We're still daylight. Now, how is that happening when the sun is still up in the air? We're still daylight. Now, how is that happening when the sun is still up in the air? We're still daylight.